my name is Kimberly and welcome to South Bay Volkswagen in sunny San Diego, California. And today we're gonna be going over everything you need to know on the digital cockpit on the 2019 Atlas. So with these buttons, you'll be able to access a lot of the stuff on the infotainment system. On the digital cockpit, the view will let you access the different views that are uh, available on the digital cockpit, whether it's your driving modes, um, your driving assist systems, your navigation, and so on. This right here will be your command button, so you can command the vehicle to, um, you know, give you directions, change your music, and text people as well. These are going to be your up and down buttons. So whenever you're going from window to window, which will be these silver buttons right here, and there, there's going to be different options that you can move up and down with, which will be these buttons that you'll be able to um, go within the the tab. So this is the digital dash on the Atlas. On the digital dash, you will be able to access a lot of the information on your vehicle. So for example, you can access the driving data coming from your speed warning to your oil temperature, your speed, average speed, distance, travel time, and so on. Now, if you click on over on these windows, this is how you will be able to access all the different features and all the different windows. This right here is going to be your assist system, which will allow you to click your lane assist, blind spot monitor, rear traffic alert, front assist. You can turn these off at any time and they will stay off if you turn off the vehicle. Um, you can go ahead and put them back on. Right now they are all on. If you go ahead and take them off, it will be deactivated and it'll let you know before you go ahead and actually deactivate it. Now the next window, you'll be able to see your navigation system. So when you click an address, um, whether it's through speaker or the actual infotainment system, you'll be able to see your um, GPS on your instrument cluster. Now you'll be able to access your audio. In your audio, you have a few different systems. So you have your USB, USB 2, Bluetooth audio, your auxiliary, and the Wi-Fi close and then we're going to go ahead and click on over to telephone. When you connect your phone, you'll be able to access your calls on this screen right here and then that right there will be your vehicle status. So if a door is open, it'll let you know exactly which door is open or um, if there's anything going on with the car, everything will be right there on the vehicle status which will be your opening window. So to change the actual dials, you'll be able to click view right here. And then there you will be able to change it from your driving assist systems to your navigation, which will give you that view right there, your economy, your economy and range, your gear and speed, and the classic view. When you change the settings on the digital cockpit, it will go up to your driver profile. You have up to three driving profiles and one guest. So whenever you change the driver profile, the settings on the digital cockpit will change as well. So there you guys go. That's how you work the digital cockpit system. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to drop them down on the comments below. Go ahead and click like and turn on those post notifications and we'll see you here at South Bay Volkswagen.